Finished self-testing. With the egg, see that? It's right there. It's a big egg. Well, anyway, I was at Lake Donegal this morning, and the weather was horrible. And it's it, on the way home. It rained like hell. You know, it was raining all over the place. And I just figured, I said, oh heck, I'll stop over here. And after I went home and unloaded the SD cards and all that crap. And I don't fly this thing that much. I just want to fly it around a little bit. The wind is kicking up here and there. It's not always windy, but it's it's kicking up here and there. So let me uh, look at these video settings real quick. All right, let's just take off and fly it around a little bit. The old egg. <laughs> camera the button on here the button on there is very sensitive And you can see it's very loud. <laughs> I'm a little worried about how windy it is up there. I don't know how this thing is in the wind, to be honest with you. I'm just not sure. I could see it bouncing around up there like crazy. Yeah, it's really, uh, wow, it's getting bounced around up there like, like wild, man. I think that wind above them trees is pretty hard. Slow. 
unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to fly it up real high, guys. It's just... It's... I want it to, I want to take it out and let Bob see it. I don't want it to get ruined before he can see the damn thing. Believe it or not, this thing's uh, pretty quick. And I just have it in the normal mode. I don't have it in the, in the, the race mode. I mean, look at the pitch on this thing. Woo! When you come down too low, the damn legs start coming down. You can see that in the in the video how when you tip it too forward like that you got to get that camera it's not really easy to get this camera set just the way you want it you know what I mean it's kind of a tricky deal what the problem with this thing is is that when you when you go to now see, now I got it pitched up too high. See? Now, there, oh, there it goes. Okay. Now it's going way too far past the thing. See, it, that's what it does. It, just at the right angle that you want. And that's very annoying. Okay, now that's not too bad right there. Yeah, I think it went up high again. Yeah, see how it goes into the thing? It's very frustrating to try to get the pitch of this camera just right. Let's go all the way down. Okay, that looks like that looks good right there. I think that's why I would want it. Very annoying. Let me see. Let me pitch it forward. Yeah, that's about where I would want it. Okay, so you see I sat here and spent three minutes trying to get the pitch of the camera straightened out. So, that's one of the annoyances of this thing. But I want to let uh, Bob have a chance to fly this, so I'm going to hopefully not tear it up too much. <laughs> Okay, I still got 55% battery. I like my map, look at it. 
<laughs> Look at that thing. <laughs> Thanks. There's a lot of people at the park today. I don't know why. It's really crappy out here. It's hot as hell. And see, that thing does never lines up with that properly either, that... The head, like I said in my last video, the head is supposed to be that power vision sign right there. And it's... it's the camera is supposed to line up with that, and that lets you know, you know, what direction you're going. But it really is not very accurate. You know... Don't be relying on that thing to navigate your butt home. I'll be honest with you. Don't, uh, don't count on that.